also, as you may or may not know, probably you know, I am nine months pregnant. So I've been doing my routine videos to document my nine month pregnant journey. I love being pregnant. It's been so much fun. But I'm ready for baby girl to get here. So this is my work routine as a nine months pregnant work from home mama. So I start out with some breakfast. This is a full filming day. So I had some carbs and some berry cream cheese to start my morning. And always a big jug of water is with me throughout the entire day to stay hydrated. Then I do my own glam because it's just easier for me, it's quicker for me. And again, I've been getting really sick, so I've been trying to isolate myself. So do my own glam, I have been learning through tutorials and I think I do a pretty okay job. I start with some makeup and then I do my hair. It's kind of minimal, but you know what? It's kind of fun and meditative and relaxing. I usually listen to a podcast, like I said, watch a tutorial. Jean Watts is one of my favorites, shout out Jean Watts. And she's been helping me learn, just like learning to cook, learning to do my own makeup. Today I was feeling a real extra and even put on some eyeliner. I'm really not great at this, but you know, I try. I even did a little contouring, so A for effort. Then I've just been straightening my hair really quickly with a flat iron 2005 style. But my hair has been growing, so if you guys are interested in a hair care routine, let me know because I feel like the products and the shampoos I've been using has helped tremendously that and not bleaching it every two weeks. One of the biggest parts of my workday is my ASMR videos. I try and do about three a day, so my hubby sets up while I get ready. He's been a huge help, especially being nine months pregnant. It's hard to be on my feet, so here he is setting up one of our first ASMR shots, and if you guys didn't know, he actually is my nail tech too. He's been helping me with the press-on nails, because again, I haven't been going to the salon. Obviously, I want short nails for my baby, and he kind of masters this, so we put on these really cute Hello Kitty nails today, and they're really, really fun to shoot in. Like, look how stunning, stunning. And he also helps me get ready and get dressed because these nails sometimes makes it a little difficult. And we kind of set everything up together. This little studio is in my walk-in closet and it has been so great for ASMR. And if you are into ASMR, please check out my ASMR channel, Trisha Paytas ASMR. This is a Hello Kitty nail tapping collection I just put up, and it's grown 250,000 subscribers in just nine months. So thank you guys so much for the love. Trisha Paytas ASMR, I will link it below. So usually after one take, then we do some lunch. We just boiled up this tortellini to split, and we kind of catch up and regroup. Usually watch TikToks or go do TikTok lives ourselves during this time, but getting some more carbs in with that pasta.
time for some more ASMR. So this is the second ASMR video of the day. It is more nail tapping, but it's also one of my role plays. Today I was doing a librarian role play, which was highly requested from the viewers. So I get all the props around and my hubby once again helps me with this. He helps me stay organized, get the mics and the camera set up and change up the green screen. And it's really been so much fun to do this. It helps get my creative juices flowing and actually helps calm my own anxieties. So I really love doing these ASMR videos. Thank you guys again for all the continued support on them. They've been so much fun. quick costume change and we are ready to shoot. This was actually one of my favorite ones to do because it was just really fun to play a character. And I make these all up as I go, improv on the spot, which has always been my dream job. And uh, yeah, I get to do it because I created it myself. Then I had some energy, so I decided to just set up the shot. I've been doing a lot of Q&As just sitting on my bed. It's really relaxing and fun for me and a really great way to connect. And it's been killing some time while I wait to give birth. So that's what I'm setting up here. And I really just love all the questions you guys have been asking and it gets my creative juices flowing as well of what to talk about. And of course, then I do some spicy content. If you guys wanna see this, go to my Twitter, at Trisha Paytas. There's a link in the bio. If you know, you know, and I love to do this too. It makes me feel sexy. Then switch it up real quick from sexy to whatever this is. And yes, this is nine months pregnant in the King Tut outfit. This was on King Tut uh, anniversary day on TikTok. Once again, if you know, you know, my TikTok is Trish Like Fish 88, and we actually hit 7 million on this day. So it was totally worth putting on this costume again. And behind the scenes, the TikToks are so funny, but this was so much fun. And I just love TikTok. It just, I love all social media. What can I say? I love my job. I love being a content creator. Then I take off the nails. I usually take these off, usually to cook. But yeah, at the end of the day, I just take some soap and water and I can reuse them. Press on nails are amazing and Etsy has great, great ones. That's where I get all of mine. I did a whole video about it on my ASMR channel. So if you wanna see the specific stores, these are from Dash Nails, I believe, and they were phenomenal, love them. And then of course I had to include my editing. This is part of kind of my everyday routine. I do a little bit in the morning, nighttime, whenever I can get it in. But of course the workday routine, you can see my, everything is kind of hurting. My feet, my back, all of that stuff like that. But my workday routine definitely ends with uploading footage. I like to get it off my camera right away just so I have it on my computer. Snacking on some Doritos because that is a must. And yeah, really just going through uploading footage, editing content, checking to see comments, replying to comments, all of that fun stuff, going on Twitter, just everything that it involves with being a content creator, just keeping everyone entertained on all the platforms because all the platforms are important to me. I love YouTube, it's my home. TikTok is definitely where you get the views. Twitter, I can promote spicy content and just other places, you know, obviously, you wanna keep up with relevancy and also just what's with going on in the world. And I like it. Each platform has a different audience. I have a lot of fun. It's always a wild ride. Twitter, I love to block the trolls. So it's the only place that really like trolls me, but yeah. Then I edit for one of my three channels. This is for my blog channel, Hit a Second Family channel, check it out. Then we do a cooking with Trish. This is the setup. Once again, my hubby has been so great helping me all throughout my pregnancy, but definitely in this home stretch because I have been loving to work. So he'll take the day off to help me with my videos. And it's really been so, so, so helpful. And it's how I get so much done throughout the day. So we're a really good team and it's really fun too, because again, we love to cook just in our free time. So this is kind of like an added bonus. If you guys like it, thanks for watching the Cooking with Trish series. It's really, really fun to learn how to cook. It's like we're in an alternate reality. We're actually like prefer cooking over takeout or going out to eat. Crazy. And 
and hot, getting winded. We do the home stretch here where we have to like present the food and get it all set up before we can even eat, take pictures on all of that fun stuff. Tonight we made fish and chips with homemade tartar sauce. If you guys wanna see that, check out the cooking with Trish on it. This is our little setup, we eat behind the counter. Our little tripod is a categories game. And yeah, it's pretty, pretty basic, but it's fun and it's simple and it makes it really easy to do. And there's our little setup and we eat. And then we're always exhausted. It was like nine o'clock at this time, like for real. We try not to be so late, but we were just so, so tired. And then of course we had to clean up. And that's the end of my work day. If you guys are interested in a nighttime routine at nine months pregnant, please thumbs up this video. I can totally do that if you wanna see the full relaxing of the day. But that was the work part. And again, I love what I do so much. I'm going to be a stay at home, work from home mom. And I am so blessed and so fortunate. I've been doing social media for 16 years and it's all because of you guys. We're headed into a new chapter, so I really appreciate it. So we'll see how life adjusts with a newborn and uh, a workaholic like myself. Again, if you love what you do, you never have to work a day in your life. I'm blessed to say that. I know not everybody is. So again, thank you guys for making it happen. Please thumbs up this video if you like the routine videos. Thumbs up this video if you're excited to meet the baby. It could happen literally any day now and I am just so, so, so excited. All right guys, I love you so much and I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye.